when you look at the global uh, picture of the dugong as uh, reflected by the united nations environment program task force and their uh, what you call the uh, status report uh, the indian ocean uh, sub species or the indian ocean genetically variant group is subject to extinction but they say is threatened vulnerable and may go extinct so in that sense the numbers are definitely much less than what we have known in the past and many factors have contributed to the loss of the habitat in the bay of mana in the mana area primarily because of the changes in development in the developed areas where the demand has come and settled and the other factor is that uh, the indian side of the bay has been declared as a dugong reserve and a mana and biosphere reserve so it is most appropriate that we in sri lanka try to complement that and try to have a dugong program which is very focused towards trying to at least protect whatever that is there because uh, we do not have any idea of the uh, abundance of the dugong in this side of the country uh, the ocean so therefore i think we need to be looking at that but while we are looking at the technical sides like that uh, the awareness should be created among the uh, persons who are using the ocean which is the fisher folk and for that i think we need to capture the larger community from schools where most of the children are from uh, that community so i think uh, it is important that we do so because it is the last uh, stock that is available in the indian ocean in and around the indian continent so i think it is uh, very important that we try to do